he does have the opportunity. And when you take a look at how he stacks up against, against Alison Vicente, he is the younger guy, 24 years old. He's giving up three inches in height. He came in at 231 pounds. Vicente at 234.6 pounds. Vicente is obviously more experienced right. at 18 and 14. But well, let's not forget Vadim Nemkov, six and two. This guy has experience competing in Japan. And tonight, he will vie to some way, somehow, get yep. into that tournament. And this is a reserve bout. This is that swing bout that we talked about that one of these guys could <laughs> jump back in this tournament. tournament. <laughs> Now don't forget the tournament rules for here Ryzen. First round is five minutes, the second round also five minutes. If they cannot determine a winner, we go to a third round, which will only be judged in that manner. Kicks and knees to the head of a down opponent are definitely legal. What is not legal are elbows to the head. No bows, baby. And we all know why, Joe. You're not gonna throw elbows in a tournament format. You don't want these guys cut up. You don't want them. You want them to be able to continue. Oh, no time wasted right, here by Vicente. No. Already, oh. already going in there, gets the takedown. It's exactly what he wants. He wants to use his jiu-jitsu versus Nemkov. Yeah, I think Metcalf got his um, foot caught in that ring and went down. He's back to his feet again. They're in a clinch. He's fighting out of it. This is definitely the Brazilian wants to bring this to the ground. He want to make this a jiu-jitsu match. What does he need to do here? Because he's got that right underhook, and he does take it down to the ground. Is this where he wants to be? Yeah, well, I mean, it depends. I, you know, he's very good on top with his ground and pound, which we're seeing here. He's in the half. You know, he's full guard, actually. So. That overhand right is landing, Joe. He is landing thunderous punches from the inside the guard here. Got to be careful, though. You cannot leave your arm extended there against a guy like Pichette. Yeah, this is, this is right out of the Fedor page book. Oh, and a beautiful two, three. He's out. He's out. He's what? out, baby. This is exactly what Vadim Nekopov wanted to do in this tournament. Yeah, that's how you do it right there. You finish that fight quick. He's a reserve bout. Now he's nice and healthy and safe. He might be pulled back in this tournament. This is exactly what everybody in this tournament wants to do. Get in and get out as quickly as possible. I said it when the broadcast started. Vadim Nemkov is the guy we may want to pay attention to because if somebody gets injured, this guy is fresh. And I believe Fedor, his coach, is happy as heck at home right now. That was right out of Right out of the playbook, right there, ground and pound, full guard. You don't see a lot of people get knocked out being in full guard with that overhand right. I mean, he, he has extreme power here, look at And we Boom. saw that there with a the beautiful right hand. First things first, we do want to make sure Allison Vicente is fine. We do have the paramedics inside the ring right now. He is breathing. We just want to make sure that he is conscious because those thunderous punches there that were landed were absolutely masterful by Nemkov. You see there the <laughs> eyes rolling back in his head. We want to make sure that he is okay. They are lifting his neck up right now, ensuring that he is breathing properly. I can see it from our position, Joe. His chest cavity is breathing. He's perfectly fine. It's a matter of making sure he is conscious. Oh, there he is. He's there getting he up now. He's helping up. We should get him out of the cage here and move forward with this tournament. He's a bit dazed, obviously dazed and confused. Yeah, well, he knows what's up. He's, got, he's having a hard time walking right now. Obviously, you get that when your, your brain shuts down the way it is. Hopefully, he makes it down the stairs. But Nemkov, what a performance here by Vadim Nemkov. No doubt making Fedor and Team Fedor proud as this guy here now right. is going to stand by potentially. Joe, competing in two days, competing potentially in the tournament. He'll be paying close attention to exactly what is happening. But thankfully, Alison Vicente is perfectly fine as he walks by our broadcast table. But tonight, it's all about Nemkov. Right now, he's going to get back 
to the room. He's going to relax. He's going to make sure he's going to likely going to want to ice his hands, Joe. Ice his knuckles. Yeah, I, I believe he can ice his knuckles or just go rest. I believe that, that was exactly what his coaches wanted. He wanted a quick finish. He didn't want to get injured at all. Um, it, it was a great performance. Coming up next, ladies and gentlemen, Kata Asukara taking on Alyssa Garcia.